It was someone who played on stream yesterday whose tag was C loss. C loss? Yeah, that's my homie now. <laughs> All right, we got Astra versus Yama starting off the Xanadu brackets. Yep, and two like Lucas. Um, I haven't seen this matchup a whole lot. Yeah, I mean it's a weird one for sure. But two Lucas can heal from the bombs, but I mean it's weird. I think he gets kept out by Z. I think they both keep each other out with Zayers. Yeah, I imagine they both keep each other out, which is why I'm surprised to see so many buttons just like being hit uh, between these two already. Oh my god, good F smash read by Yama. He is turning it up right now. Yeah, he is. The thing about the thing about Lucas um, in this matchup, I don't know. It, it seems kind of when I see another tether character fight a tether character, it, like changes the entire game because they both aren't characters that are gonna. They're both not players you're gonna grab much in general, so it changes everything. Yeah, but I mean, Two Link's grab is, or recovers fairly fast. Or, um, excuse me, Luke's grab recovers fairly fast. Two Link's is kind of slower. Okay. Yeah. All so right. I wouldn't be surprised to see a couple grabs coming from after, especially since it's uh, one of Luke's biggest skill confirms. I mean, not at this percent, because they're just both so high and so much rage. Dead? Oh. Ooh. Yeah, dead? It's for Reed, also dead. Yeah. Yeah, you know, wait. Took wait. the long way around, but still is going to work. I mean, when you can confirm off of insert projectile. You're going to get the hit eventually. Yeah. I mean, you can block, you know, 15 different bombs, but if 16 hits you, mm, it's going to hurt. Yeah. That's the Toon Link life. Yeah. That's what happens when you drink enough Soylent. <laughs> I don't know. I was hoping you would maybe grow a bit more if you drank some Soylent. Like, they're both kind of small. That's a lot of calcium in there, if I remember right. Milk? No, oh, Soylent. Soylent. Yeah. Uh, see, I don't know what's Soylent. I don't know what's in Soylent. I'm always talking about it because I always want to try it. I just imagine it tastes like nothing. It tastes like eSports. eSports! <laughs> Alright, but right now Astro's kind of running away with it. Ever since, it was so even until they took that first stock, and now, like, Astro is just staying back. He's letting Yama come to him because he knows the position that he's in. That was a beautiful pivot grab. Like, Into nothing! Yeah, he opted not to throw because he didn't want to stale his back throw properly. Uh-oh! Uh, yeah, lots of rolls coming through from both of them, but um, Yama's still alive. So I think Toonlink's back throw will kill. Uh, so yeah, probably. It'll definitely kill on the on there. Oh yeah, Toonlink's back throw is live. Yeah, it's like one of the top three strongest in the game, right? Second strongest. Ooh. Oh wait. Yeah, second strongest. <laughs> I think it's only right. Only one stronger is Ness. I think Mario is third. Nah, that can't be right. No, Mario's back there is extremely fast and strong. But not that strong. No, 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 no. it is. It, it really is. It's top five. Um. Oh, oh landing with the back air. That's going to do it. Punching that air dodge lag, too. Uh, something I didn't talk about earlier is that Ness and Lucas's air dodges are really hard to punish because they dip in the Z-axis and like they just are always floating around with their PK kitchen shenanigans. So... In situations like that, it's probably better to just go down, punish that landing lag, and take that W. Oh, yeah. But here comes Yama's main. The true main. Ness. He's a PK master. The one that Americans actually remember. Ha. Huh. I feel bad about that. Please, Nintendo, bring Mother 3 to the United States. So many people would buy that. I don't, I don't see a reason that Lucas was added and Wolf wasn't to this day. I think I'm sensing some salt there, Joe. Of course. <laughs> Just doesn't add up to me. Wolf has been in multiple games in the U.S. Hmm. Wolf O Donnell. I was mad because yesterday I was thinking of the phrase, um, "Can't let you do that," and I'm like, "Where did this come from?" And I'm like, "Wait, as a wolf main." Yeah. I may be mad because I forgot Wolf said it. It's been a while. Uh, it must be a bad feeling. It, it kind of is. I'm sure you feel the same way every time you pick Dealey on the select screen in Smash 4. We won't talk about that. <laughs> you know what? There's another match going on, which um, Yama's playing a lot more comfortable this time. But we saw how the first game started. It was Ooh. even until it wasn't. <gasps> yeah, he was fishing for that back right there. Oh, he wants it. Yeah. Woo! Although it wouldn't kill. Uh-oh. Smacks. Not going to kill on Battlefield, though. Even at 126. Chuck, Chuck. Chuck, Chuck. Good catch by Yama. Oh! He tried to back roll, grab as Ness. You, sir, have cojones. Yeah, I mean, it was a pretty um, cheap situation that he kind of set up right there. He's just kind of waiting for Yama to, you know, force himself back to a corner and then roll behind him back roll. But Astra is just I, not I, falling for it. 
I like the you. <laughs> He's he, dead. He might not. Nah, he should be able to make it. Oh. Yeah, he was gonna make it regardless. Courtesy stocks. Hmm. He'll die from like the middle of the stage from Toon Link's back. <laughs> yeah, but by the ledge, actually, Astro's probably pretty close to kill percent with this heaping mountain of rage that's on. I think either player that lands a back throw will kill, no matter where it is. Um, that's probably not center stage. It's no. true, but it's not that. Uh, maybe now. Maybe no, now. Uh, at a hundred percent max rate, he's dead. That should be it. Yep. I'm sorry, you ain't gonna live that. Yeah, especially now at 160. But that back air coming Ooh. through. Ooh. Yeah, still living. Ooh. Okay. PK Thunder. PK Thunder. No death, but he got a lot of damage off that. Like maybe some 20 so percent. So uh, it could have been worse. But he just really needs to get the stock. And the here comes the best special. The triple back roll. Uh oh. I'm actually surprised that Pokemon off the ledge, but back air going to do it from the other side of the, side of the stage right there. Um, Smack. Yes, yeah, smack for days. All right. Yeah, I wish something that they add in this game is that, like, you know, in um, Earthbound, when they hit someone, it just has like a smack noise, and like it writes the words on the screen like a comic book. I haven't played Earthbound. Oh, pretty good game. I believe you. But yeah, I wish they added that for Ness. That'd be a pretty cool effect. Now Yama's not a player who doesn't tend to. Uh, he doesn't take too many risks. I don't know if you can tell, but this man does not really. Uh, doesn't really go off stage. He doesn't really put himself out there. He's just chilling. I feel like this one of those matchups where you actually could go off stage if you want to. Oh, Tunic's, yeah. Uh, hitbox on his upbeat. It's kind of big, but if you challenge it from above and fall into him, it's a bit more consistent than hitting him out of it. If I was Ness, I would spike his life. Yeah, that spike's actually pretty hard to land. I Wait. would spike his life. I don't care. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now Astro's playing on his back foot. Oh! Big finish right there coming in from Yama. Reading the air dodge. Forcing the air dodge, rather. Uh, taking that game two with a beautiful PK Thunder, too. I feel like I knew that was going to happen. I, I mean, like, when he's throwing out all those PK Thunders, like, and you have to dodge one of them eventually, it's just a matter of time for you hit by something big. Or you just kind of get hit in all position, you end up just holding that out. Best commentator in the world, Nira, has made his presence known in the building. <laughs> what a guy. What a guy. Yeah. All right. Game three. Going off to Duck Huntu. And he has switched to Blue Tunlinku. Yep, but. Oh. Yama managed to um, maintain the green nest, which I actually think is a really good pick. Yeah, I mean. Really good. Well, I mean, good for the stage. I can't hear myself right now. It's alright, we just gotta believe. Okay. Always trust him again. Alright, so Ness. There we go. There we go. <laughs> alright, Ness going for some things. Alright, hitting the duck. It's gonna appear in the middle of the stage. Nope. Right hand side. Healed, but still damaged. Yeah. If Another I remember right, bombs don't scale with rage, so that healing is going to be pretty flat all the way through. Oh, yeah. Give him the work. Hmm. Uh-oh. All right. They're kind of feeling each other out, not really doing anything at the moment. The weird thing is, they felt each other out the last two games. It's just kind of like Astro's kind of looking lost because Yano's ready, more ready to adapt. Sure, there's his counter pick, but I don't think he was ready to play from behind right now. Especially on like a stage like Duck Hunt. He was like, all right, I'm going to get this lead. I'm going to hang out on a platform. You want to chill? It's going to be good. But when Ness comes out hitting buttons and you're at 121%, it's like, oh, man. Yama is not approaching. Not that he has to. Yeah, there's no need for him to right now. Because otherwise you're going to get hit by situations like these. That should have been a stock by Yama. This should be a... He, he should be grabbing. Uh, he has to get close enough first. And that's the thing, like, when he's really fishing for these kills, like, in these situations, like, you can tell he's fishing just by the fact that he's moving forward like that. Um, he yeah, might, he's... Yeah, he he's might have a hard, harder time. He went from... Play. Okay. Yep, yep, that's I was going to say, it. he went from an 80% win to, like, almost even. And Astro hasn't changed his gameplay up at all. Uh, not very much, but... Uh, oh, man, Astro just chilling. Yeah, so, well, now that he's playing from behind, like a stock behind... Oh, Ooh. and even more now that uh, that little recovery went off. I feel like he's just going to kind of have a hard time keeping his mind composed like that. Good air dodge read. Oh. PK flash. All right, Yama, I need you to calm down with the disrespect. Is he holding a bomb? Oh, I didn't know that worked. Oh, that's a cute option right there. I like that. <laughs> he had to go to the other side of the stage to do it. I mean, when you're that far ahead, why not? PK flash? No, please. Oh, God. Uh, that he, almost hit. He almost ended his life. 
back up here. Okay. Oh, yep. Might not have been optimal DI, but he was really high, and that was a lot of really Aerial up a smash you. Yeah, that move is strong. 